In this video, I'm going to walk you through the unit mute permissions in permission set groups. This is the last unit in the module permission set groups. I've added bookmarks so you can watch the whole thing or just jump to the part that you're stuck on. And yeah, I know it feels a little cheesy to be wearing my trailhead hoodie, but I'm cold. I feel like this unit does a really nice job explaining what muting is and like walking you through the thinking that you would need to do to understand like why you would want to mute in certain circumstances and not mute in others and like how that works. So please do take a close look at this content. One thing that I didn't explain was this concept of a managed package. Managed packages are, as the help page says, a collection of components and applications that are made available to other orgs through the app exchange. And before your brain goes foggy thinking I'm never going to use this, App Exchange apps are one of the key values of using Salesforce because you have access to the whole range of what developers have made to help configure your Salesforce org even more efficiently for your industry or business model or chances are you're going to want to be using these and need to understand how using managed packages is going to be impacting your permission sets. So do take a close look at this. After you've completed the steps in this unit, let's jump ahead to the hands-on challenge. We're going to mute permissions in a permission set group. Update the sales processing permission set group to prevent its assigned users from editing and deleting contracts. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna mute the edit and delete permissions for contracts by going to the permission set group sales processing. So you're gonna click on sales processing muting permission set contracts permissions muted click on muting permission set in group and you're going to click new fill out the label contracts permission muted and the api name is automatically filled in then click save and then you're going to click on this muting permission set and now we've created this but we haven't given any logic yet so now we're going to click object settings go into the contracts object And we're going to mute, edit, and delete. And modify all also gets selected there. And then click save. That should do it.